Well today we've got the Haynes Hunter 575 Pro Fish. It's uh, the one of a new range that Haynes Hunter are doing this season. Really what they've done, they've cut out a lot of the unnecessary uh, luxury items uh, and in this instance we have a boat that's uh, nearly 5.9, oh, nearly a 6 metre boat so you've got a fairly decent offshore boat. A very solid hull because what Haynes Hunter have done in uh, recent years, they've actually upped the specs on their boats, made them a lot stronger. And we have here also a boat that has um, a cuddy, uh, so you have uh, somewhere to store your gear, a bit of overnight sleeping capacity if needed. The boat sits on a dual axle tinker trailer. I think we'll be getting on the water shortly and uh, see how it runs. We've had a run, it's been a bit of a windy day, which in many ways is good because that really shows up the value of these boats, the Haynes Hunt over Deep V, and the advantage of that is you get a much softer ride in choppy water. Um, we had uh, a, a short sharp chop, um, and in that the boat was able to do near its maximum speed, which is quite impressive. We're really looking at a very basic package. Um, uh, we, the extras you may add to the boat, and certainly a new sounder uh, of some description would, would be probably the starting point. But uh, you may add extra rod holders, uh, outriggers, uh, but that can all come later. The whole idea is to get the starting package down so it's uh, easier to get into, not too expensive. Um, we're talking package here, 52 is pretty good.